Welcome to Shorts 9. I uh, probably got enough for one more after this, but then I'll be struggling. I really need this game to release now. Oh, brother, I need this game to release now. Just send, just give me the tools for 30 quid. Finish the campaign off and sell me that for 20 quid. And then release the full version at the end of the year. I think most people would take that. But anyway, on to this. I quite like this. The music. Just, I don't know, the music sort of does something that makes me want to just continue playing this level. It's quite a simple idea. And I believe this was one of the first things made. Or one of the very first things. Obviously not the first thing, but one of the very first things made. And it is rather good. This, I just thought, was a great realisation of a location. It, it's got, you know, it feels like a junkyard. It looks like a junkyard. It does what it says on the tin. I don't know why, but I felt a little bit motion si of motion sickness when I was playing this. But look at that for a car. Fully realised. I don't know what like, this is like on the thermo. There's a lot of stuff there in that garden. Like the one in that junkyard, I mean. You've got a little guitar there, look. Nothing in the house at the moment. Sound goes down though when you go in the house, which is a nice touch. Running the river. Sound is so important. Dreams makes you realise how difficult it is to be a developer, isn't it? I mean, we take everything for granted. We just play them and don't think about what's going on behind the scenes. This game reminds you of what's going on behind the scenes. This one, I don't know why, but I got a Zelda type vibe from it. And I'm sure this is something to do with Zelda. Tell, let me know in the chat because... I just, I don't know. I'm probably being ignorant there. And everybody's shouting at the screen saying, Yes, it is. This is so and so. Well, I don't know. Look at it. It's quite nice. It's quite nice. I didn't get very far in it. At this point, I was in a rush to try to grab as much footage as I could and didn't know how long I'd got. So I didn't bother working this puzzle out. This one, very mirrors, mirrors Edge, don't you think? I mean, it was, I mean, how can you not draw the conclusion that this is a Mirrors Edge type game? You got the colour, the vibrant colours. Got rooftop climbing and jumping, you know. Very good, very good. And it looks like, like the way they've got a city. Look how far back the city is. Look at it. Very simple city, yeah, but it's still good. The sense of scale. Oh, forgot to jump. My gameplay. <laughs> this one just made me laugh. I can't stop thinking of his buns now, though. Now that John's played it, or seen it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Would how long it took him to make that character? Two spheres for his bottom, two spheres for his shoulders. But then, you know, there's lots of other little details. This I put it in because of potential. You know, obviously this guy hasn't finished this yet location. He's building it out. He's going to colour it clearly. I wasn't sure about the bowling, though. The bowling he's sorting out goes a bit too fast. I just could not get it to go down the middle. I was, pr ooh, I, was pr I was pressing furiously at the end, thinking, come on, go down the middle. But he's added a little bit of colour to this location, so you have to assume that he's going to colour the rest of it eventually. This is, this is, but it's quite good. I remember going round home. It wasn't my cup of tea, but it was still nice. The, obviously, the advantage of this one is... You can get four, you and, I don't know how many people are going to have, maybe eight, 
maybe you can have, be able to allow eight in a multiplayer game but once multiplayer releases be able to have other characters other than sort of home related characters which will be fun this one I put it in because I like that opening cutscene and the music and I'd be interested to see where it goes you know stranded on a desert island just basically you're walking around the island taking a look at the situation but you know yeah yeah I'd be more than happy to play something like this I like exploration quite impressive I think what people have done in such a short time so another one comes to an end Goodbye, totally pip, au revoir, and all that good stuff. See you everyone. Thanks for watching, and when the game comes out, I will have stacks more content and unique content. So don't worry about that. It just needs to come out, and come out now. Bye.